Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today, I'm going to show you how to set the default GPU for your Blender 3.0. You can see this is my Blender 3.0. When I try to move some actions here, then it have the real-time rendering in my default GPU, the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 950M. When I do something, you can see this is the real-time rendering process on my 3D software of the Blender 3.0. And now you can see I have two GPU, that is the GPU 0 and GPU 1. The GPU 0 is the integrated graphic. And what about if some of you, you have three GPU or two GPU in your computer, and how are you going to make sure that the Blender is going to run by using the GPU that you want it to use. For example, now I have a dedicated, dedicated NVIDIA GeForce GTX G GPU. This is 950M. Of course, this is the best in this computer. I want to make sure that the Blender is going to utilize the GPU once. So how? All right, so now I'm going to show you step by step how to perform all of this. Right now, this is my window 10. This is my window 10. The first thing, what am I going to do? I'm going to right click here. Look at the task manager. From the task manager, by default, you should be able to see the performance. And here you can see your CPU activity, your GPU, GPU 0 and GPU 1. So, so all of this. All right. So, from this task manager, I'm going to put it at the side first. And then, you check the performance at here. Just put it at here first. Next, you are going to open the Blender's directory. So you may just right click the file explorer, click the file explorer, and then the Blender will be installed at here. Usually it's the local disk C, all right, click the local disk C, the program file, Blender Foundation. Blender 3.0 is here. And the applications, this is the one, the Blender.exe. This is the Blender's applications. Next, we are going to select, we are going to select the default GPU for the Blender. So you have to click here to search the graphic. Once you type in the graphic, then it will show the graphic setting here. The graphic setting, click into the graphic setting. And now you can see, you have to go and browse. Click browse. Go and browse the Blender. Of course, now since you already opened the Blender 3.0 directory, you just need to click here and then Control C to copy. Control C to copy the destination locations. And then at the open here, you click here. Control V to paste, then press enter. Now, you'll be inside the Blender's folder. This is the one, the Blender. So you click add. You click here to make sure you select it already. It is highlighted by using the blue color. And then you click add. Now you can see it already have the option here. Click the option and make sure that you select the GPU that you want. You have two GPU and the name is here. The first one is my integrated Intel HD Graphic 630 GPU. And another one is my dedicated NVIDIA GeForce GTX GPU. I'm going to choose this. It is up to you. Of course, you can choose this as well. It is up to you. Now, I'm going to choose the default GPU. This is just to make sure that for every time when the window 10 run the Blender. It is going to run on the default GPU of the NVIDIA GeForce GTX. I choose here, I click Save, and then, now it is already have a record here. That means next time, for every time when you run the Blender, when you run the Blender, then you can have a check. Now, this is the Blender 3.0. I put it at the left hand side. And then the task manager, I always look at this graph. See, when I have some actions of the real-time rendering, 
it is going to utilize my default GPU that's selected for Blender 3.0, that is NVIDIA GeForce GTX GPU. When I do some real-time rendering, it is utilizing my NVIDIA dedicated GPU. All right, that is the way on how to select the default GPU for your Blender 3.0. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy, happy animation and game developing. See you.